Hello and welcome to episode 111 of RA Place Factorio C block. Uh, we just finished up transistors, so we're gonna bring all of that together to get uh, these guys. So we have the circuit boards, we have the transistors, we have the components, and we have the solder. Um, yeah, so we'll bring this up here. Uh, we'll have some underground, let's craft some more belt as well. Uh, so underground like this, uh, underground like this. Um, do we, yeah, I think we want to bring, uh, let, let me just check how, how the resource division is. So I guess, let's see. Yeah, so I guess it, it would make sense to actually not put these on the same belt, but instead have, uh, let's see, so instead have uh, these go on a belt with uh, the red circuits, uh, which we can sneak through here if we move the power pole just a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. So we'll go like this. Yep, that's gonna be okay. We'll run you through here. Uh, go underground. And then come here. And go underground. And then underground again. And we'll have the red circuits going. Uh, okay. So we can merge the red circuits with these guys probably. That's that'll be fine. We'll bring those up here. Uh, you guys will bring down here, and we're gonna merge you with the solder, uh, which is gonna come from here. And uh, let's see. So uh, you guys, we go like this, and we'll bring some underground belt in here. And we'll craft some more. Let's just craft some normal belt and then a couple underground belts, some splitters as well. And yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're gonna fill in some landfill here because I, I needed to make the belt the bus look nice. Uh, so, we're gonna go up here, we're gonna also make you guys go underground. Uh, we finished some research, that's good. Let's, let's get polishing, sure, why not? Um, yeah, so we have the belt going up. And let's see, so uh, we can do a little wiggle to mark our territory. Uh, let's do it like this. Right? Yeah, that comes out at the right angle. Uh, we're, we're gonna merge you guys like this. Uh, we'll run the red boards underground for a bit. Uh, build this in a little bit. And then we've got. Yeah, everything we need for. That except this one. Yeah. Okay, so we can do an electronics assembly machine for you guys. And then we need two input inserters, one output inserter should be totally fine. Um, and we'll connect that up like this. And you'll pick up from here. Okay, so this is gonna be the electronic circuit board. So uh, let's see. So for you guys, we need the advanced circuit. That's that's basically where we're at. Um, so and what do we need to make this into an advanced circuit? We need electronic circuits, we need aluminum plate, and we need copper cable. Okay, so let's bring up the aluminum plate, and let's bring up the electronic circuits. 
Uh, we might... Yeah, let's start with the aluminum plate. Uh, uh, or actually, let's see. Let's check out where the electronic circuits are at. But I think we can safely... Let's see. Yeah, you're over here. Yeah, we want to bring you up. Um... Let's see, we're just gonna snake you through though, so let's uh, do some underground maneuvering over here. Like this, right? That should be okay. And then like this, did I skip? No, th this is fine. Uh, we're gonna put in a splitter for you, like that. And then go over here. And get going. Okay, so we'll connect up here and we'll bring this up. Uh, let's craft some more belts. We'll have to pick up more iron too, but that's fine. We know what, where we're going. Um, okay, you're good. Let's fill this in. Um, yeah, here we would use an underground belt because we're, we're splitting off this guy to the right. So that's fine. Uh, here we are gonna make you go underground though. Yep, that's good. And we'll bring you up all the way, almost all the way. You're going underground. And you're going underground. Let's go. Okay. Um, this is. So these are the green circuits which we need um, and then what else do we need? The aluminum plate basically, right? Yeah. Uh, and the copper cable, we can also make that happen. Like the copper is right here. Uh, so let's craft some more of you guys and some more underground belts. And then we should be good to go on that front as well. Um, I'm still okay making the, the copper cable locally. Um, uh, from yeah I, I want to be making the copper cable locally we could do it with coils as well which would be more belt efficient but for now uh, I'm totally okay doing it uh, with plates yeah so the only thing left is to bring up the aluminum plates uh, and then we're good this is gonna draw on resources for a little bit um, but that's that's okay we we want that uh, to happen. Um, yeah, this is all fine. Actually, it's, it's real good. Um, yeah, here we're lacking copper. Yeah, so if we're if we would be if we would be getting real low on copper, we might wanna balance something out here. Um, but as long as yeah, the mineral sludge is not backlogging then I'm I'm okay with this so I just want to uh, keep stuff going uh, and as long as we uh, use it then we're good um, yeah so let's go grab some iron plates from our buffer yeah, we're actually like production wise it's actually quite okay we're, I'm I'm totally good having a little bit more iron because we're also like, building a lot of belts. Um, yep, we're going to bring this up and we'll run some transport belts from here. I guess yeah, this used up our backlog in quite a nice way. Um, and we're gonna bring this up here. Uh, go underground for a bit and then turn the corner uh, I am just gonna dive below this pump that's fine it's not not the best but uh, it'll work and we're, then we're gonna bring up the aluminum plate all the way yeah so I mean we have a lot of space here that's going unused. Um, so, but I actually think we might want to bring up the science packs instead. Right, that that makes 
a lot of sense from a, a resource perspective, just like having a belt up there with science packs, um, rather than bringing the blue down here. I think we're, we're good on that. Like, I, I would want to go that way. Um, yeah. Let's do that. Uh, so, yeah, the, the plates are coming in, so that's good. And we want to bring this all the way up. And so we can run this next to the, the mono silicon. And for the gold, when we need it, we'll need a new, new part of the belt. Uh, yeah, we're gonna actually run some landfill here. Yeah. So we're, we're really being a lot more liberal with our landfill. And that's fine, right? But we can afford it. Uh, so I'm more than happy to do that to uh, get our base a little bit more organized. And uh, that is worth a lot to me. Uh, yeah. So uh, if we look at you guys. Yeah, basically, if we make the copper cable, then we have the rest right here. Right, so uh, let's fill this in a little bit. We're gonna bring up the copper uh, with a little wiggle, uh, like this, and we're gonna make some uh, some copper cable with that in uh, one of you guys, uh, like this. Uh, copper cable. Yeah, this should be fine. And then what we want to figure out is how are the ratios for this. So it's um, a lot of copper and a lot of aluminum with a few boards. So it makes sense to uh, merge you guys. Uh, Yep, let's craft some of you and then a lot more basic transport belts. And we'll, uh, we'll get. Let's see. We'll continue researching lithium processing. That's probably useful for something. Probably better batteries, is my guess. But maybe something else as well. So, you guys are gonna come together and then we're gonna bring... Uh, I, I was wondering if we connected all that up, but uh, it's fine. There it, there it comes. Uh, yeah. We're gonna have to grab some more landfill. Uh, but I think we're good on this. Um, yeah. We should be at least. Like I'm not worried we don't have enough of that. Yeah, so I I think I do I am gonna bring up the science packs probably. Like we could we can claim we'll likely be able to claim a lot of this space for like processing of stuff. Uh, like ores and stuff and, and bring this up that's that's I'm not like it we could be a little bit more space efficient if we look at it like this like the fact that we're, we're running all this belt up here is kind of wasteful in some sense but it really uh, like at some point we're probably gonna run into resource issues or yeah, organization issues. Like it's gonna be a while before we get robots and until that point I don't wanna end up like in like over here we're already like encroaching on spaghetti town again. Like especially this stuff. It's just I mean it looks nice but it's a little bit too spaghetti ish. 
Um, landfill, 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 and then and here there's nothing. That's fine. But here we should have some more. So we have a little bit less than last time. Like, like couple, last couple times we go, went ahead and grabbed some. We had like 2k landfill going around, and now it's just 1k. So we do want to take care a little bit. That we're not sort of overextending on that moment. Um, yeah, the iron is actually being consumed still, but yeah, we have. Is this the bottleneck? I guess. Oh, we could actually use another casting machine. Maybe we should have that then. It looks like. I think the ratio might be one to three actually. But yeah, as is, we're, I'm not really worried and it's it's okay as is, so I'm not gonna complain. Uh, this is emptying out nicely. Uh, so yeah, we're just gonna set up the circuit production and then we're good. Yeah, this, it, it does look real nice, like we can scale this up when we need to. I don't know if we're gonna need to scale it up, but if we if we need to, then we can. And yeah, basically, there's gonna be a point where I'm gonna say, hey, uh, maybe I shouldn't be so liberal. Um, there's gonna be a point where I'll say, hey, let's uh, be a little bit more uh, like building out robots to the sides of this, and at that point. We're still good. Like it's it's mainly the belt that's that's the expensive part of this operation. The landfill we would need whatever re direction we expand it, and the fact that we're not uh, not using so much to um, basically get our uh, like the alternative would be to. Basically, yeah, what would be the alternative? I don't actually want to um, to think about that. Like, if if we if we would build this closely together, it might work. But if we like, it would quickly bottleneck on one product, and uh, that's just not where I want to be. Okay, so this can then produce you guys. Okay, finally. So, we're now at a point where we have the red circuits. So now the question is, what are we gonna do with that? So, for this we need the nitrogen gas, which we have all the way down, but we could bus up and I think we will like I don't I don't want to do that everywhere um, for you guys we need the glass we need the gold plates yeah, so I'm just gonna bus all of that up and we're gonna do it up here so then the only thing is that I probably want to bring down bring up the science packs one and two We'll run that up through the bus and we'll just relocate the entire science area somewhere up here. We could do it to the left of the belt of the bus, mm, but I'm not too inclined to do that. Um, I'm also like, we could be a lot more efficient by building on the left side, but again, like, we're gonna have some more, like, a lot more products go up here. Uh, the fact that we have these belts as a sort of natural buffer, I'm totally fine with. Uh, so yeah, I'm I'm just gonna go in and handle that as is. And uh, I'm gonna find out. Yeah, I forgot to put this up here, right? Yeah. So now we should be able to make some red circuits. Good stuff. Advanced electronic circuit. Right, that's what it's, yeah, advanced, just advanced circuit. Okay, so that's good stuff. Um, yeah, 
and you guys we're, we're gonna we'll need nitrogen gas for you so are we gonna do the atomic sensors array first or are we gonna do the other stuff first uh, I think it makes sense to do this guy first, right? We're not gonna... Um, I'm, I don't want to cannibalize this space, I think. Um, do I? I? I'm not sure, actually. Um, yeah, I think it's just nicer to just go all the way up there and build it there. That's, that's fine. Um, so I think I want to get started with this. Uh, the advanced circuits, I think we want to give a place on the bus. Like, those are probably used in a bunch of stuff. Right, advanced circuits. Uh, where are, yeah, there's a hundred recipes. So it's probably mostly machines. Uh, storage chest as well. Like a bunch of robot stuff. I want to bust these, but th then the question is, do we want to bust you guys? Uh, no, you're only used in advanced circuits. So we, we clearly do want to bust the advanced circuits. Um, so then the question is, uh, where does it go? And I think the answer is quite clearly here. Oops, that's not good. Uh, uh, let's just use a small power pole. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bust the advanced circuits over here. So I'm, I'm, go I'm just gonna make that so it's gonna be this line, right? So next to you guys, next to this guy. Let's see, so over here, over here, over here. So I'll, I'll just run that line um, and actually, so if we do that, I think it makes sense, maybe, let's see, so we could immediately do the other, like the science stuff up here, or we could split it up from here but I think it makes sense to first do the science stuff up here so that's fine uh, we're gonna do more research gem processing sure now uh, we're also gonna craft a bunch of copper pipe like a bunch a bunch of transport belt as well yeah we're gonna need a lot of those both of them um, Let's see, so I will grab some more copper out of here. Oh, we actually don't have that much. Um, yeah, we have a bunch of crops in the way now, so that's that's fine. Um, we're gonna get the gold. Uh, so we'll run that up here. And yeah, there we go. Um, let me hydrate. Yeah, um, we'll continue on stream, uh, but I'm gonna cut this episode for YouTube. Uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.